Well, and that is a poor error. Golan will be seething with that situation. On the unforced error. So, first real unforced error from Castagnet on game ball and the Spanish fights on. Down. Oh, he's made the error. Did that in the first game, Castagnet. Oh, it's good recovery from Castagnet. He's doing. This is ridiculous. Oh, he's oh, he shut him out. Great shot. What a shot. He played the ball there brilliantly. What a rally because Golan was throwing everything at the Frenchman. Look at him breathing and wincing, but that is guts, mate. Well, after a very long, intense match ball rally, we've got a let ball. It has to be replayed. 10-8. Oh, he's done oh, it. He's, done it. he's the luck. absolutely the had the fortune. He's mishit it, but he really does deserve it, Mathieu Castagnier. He has taken so many of the top players all the way to the wire and not converted. Well, a titanic struggle between these two Europeans, Mathieu Castagnier scoring the biggest scalp of his career and the tournament. 11-7, 9-11, 8-11, 11-9, 11-8. Three games to two. Better length from Alan Klein. Much better constructive rally. Good accuracy down the backhand side wall. Squeeze the opening and then just a very simple, straightforward drop. Six ten. Took the ball on the top of the ball. bounce. So encouraging sign for the Scotsman. Down. Oh, that's a tight. That's an untidy 11, error. That's a technical down. issue back there, Joey, isn't it? Really. Well, Mohamed El Shabagi's managed to pull away from six all quite quickly with four game balls. Down. Oh, that's sloppy. Untidy error there from Alan Klein in the end, but full credit to Shibagi. Yeah, good squeeze. Good presence across the middle from Alan Klein there. Well, he's ball. not lying down, which is good to see. Oh, he's clearly standing up. <laughs> All right. <laughs> you. This is the finish. Game match to well, Shibagi. Alan Klein, fortunately not getting any joy against a very, very sharp Mohamed El Shabagi. 30 minutes for this second round encounter. El Shabagi on absolute fuego. 11-6, 11-6, 11-6. Three games to love. Well, this is a bit of whitewash first game here from the Frenchman. Game Completely to thundered that game ball into game the nick, full of confidence. Another unforced error. Adrian looking a bit frustrated there, talking to himself. Oh, six game balls hit from the French Dynamo. And that is oh. perfect. That's an outrageous shot, though. I mean, it was an angle, but the way he's played this with it. Oh, and the unforced error there. Still three match balls for Gaultier. Down. 
And there it is, beautiful length to finish the game off. 11-4, He's doing 28 minutes of squash. Gregory Gaultier, an absolute masterclass. Poor old Adrian Waller, 11-1, 11-4, 11-7. He wins three games to love. He's absolutely flying through this first game for Darwish. He's got such good hands as well, so the touch is there. But that's uh, Gregoire's point with a great, kind of like a double pump at the front there and then whips it cross court right at the last second. Oh, he's clipped the top of the tin, so after a slight momentum change there for the Frenchman, unforced error with the boast. Get the points on the board. Well, trouble. You can't give any time to Kareem Darwish in the front two corners. Ten one. If you don't lose the rally side, straight away. He certainly makes you pay for it. Look at this for a cross court. Marsh just running in circles. So, ten one. Nine game balls for the Egyptian. Not up. Not up. Not up. He thought it was good. Was it looked good to me. What do you and think? I thought Jackson? it was pretty good actually. Ball. But we may see this again. Yeah, he clearly gets his racket underneath the ball there. Looks looks good in the replay. Um, well, game. didn't have to wait too much longer to close out the second. Another unforced error from the Frenchman. Clearly looking out of sorts. But full credit, a sound and solid performance from Gregoire. Darwish trying to move the ball around a little bit. Slow the pace down. They're both feeling it now. Both the paces dropped. And Marsh taking the opportunity to volley there. Well, that was a double. I can't believe it hasn't been called down, but the rally carries on. I think we'll definitely see an appeal here from Gregoire Marsh. There's one pickup in particular that possibly is in question. Oh, and he holds him in there. That's down. clever again. <laughs> what a horrible way match. to finish. Well, they're both Darwish bent over double. Marsh he doesn't want to leave the court. He He's not happy. Him and Marsh so Darwish. Darwish. Here we go on the replay. Well, yeah. It looks as though he gets his racket. I mean, he doesn't even have his high on the ball. Head down, racket up. That's an incredible pickup. Possibly a slippery banana for Karim Darwish, but he came through it in pretty solid form in the end. 43 minutes it took the Egyptian to, be, to dispose of Gregoire Marsh. Three games to love, 11-5, 11-2, 12-10.